Hi, my name is Tony, and in this video, we are going to be walking through the process of uploading a third-party variable rate prescription into the John Deere Operations Center. Now, whether you're working with a third-party farm management software, or maybe you have somebody else like a crop consultant, agronomist, or an ag service provider that is writing the prescriptions for you, Either way, we have a very simple way of getting those prescriptions into the John Deere Operations Center so that you can upload them with a setup file into the display. The first thing I want to go over is just basic file format when it comes to a map-based prescription or a shape file. So you'll see here I have three files on my desktop. Now, whatever third party you're working with, again, the software or, or another person, you may get these raw files individual like this. Now, if you do, we are going to need to take these three files, which are the .dbf, .shp, and .shx, and we're going to have to zip those files or compress those files into a zip folder. Each prescription, each individual prescription needs to be its own zip folder or zip file. The way to do that is actually pretty simple. All we need to do is highlight those three files, right click, send to compressed zipped folder. Once you do that, you'll notice a zip folder populated on my desktop. You can then name it whatever you would like. Uh, we'll just leave it with the RDO0618 for uh, this video. But that is how you get each individual file into a compressed zipped folder. Now you see here I have a training prescription folder already on my desktop, and I have three different prescriptions in this folder. They're all each individually zipped or compressed, in order to get them into the John Deere Operations Center. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk through the process of how do we upload those files. So where we need to start is the John Deere Operations Center. Whether you go to uh, myjohndeere.com and sign in, or you just go to operationscenter.deere.com to sign in, uh, we need to be in the Operations Center. Once we're in our Operations Center logged in with our credentials, we click the More button. From there, we go to Files, and once we get into the Files page, the process is very simple. Go over to the right-hand side and click Upload Files. We'll then select the files we want to use. So again, on my desktop, I had this Training RX folder, and I have three prescriptions within that folder. Initially, let's just take this Centera prescription and we will click open and it shows up in our upload files window. We click upload and it will then show up in our operation center files. You'll see it's the name of the prescription that it's being recognized as a prescription because we have those shape files included and then when we uploaded it. Now, a question I get a lot is, can I batch upload or can I upload multiple prescriptions at one time? And the answer is yes, and the process is exactly the same. So what we do is we go to Upload Files, select the files we want to upload, and we're going to take, by holding Shift and clicking on these other two prescriptions that I did not upload, we'll highlight both of them, select Open, and you'll see they show up in the Upload Files window. Click Upload, and they will both show up in the Operation Center files just like that first one. So if you have 5, 6, 7, 10, 15, uh, you're able to upload all of those uh, in a batch upload. Once we have them into our files page, like you see here, we can select individual files, we can select all of them, we can then send them to the equipment, either transferring to equipment via wireless data transfer, or if we're going to download utilizing the John Deere data manager in order to get them onto a flash drive. 
But that is the overall process of walking through or how to get a third-party prescription uploaded into the John Deere Operations Center. Thank you for watching. Connect with us by subscribing to Precision Ag Answers on YouTube and following RDO Equipment Company on social media. Visit rdoequipment.com for more Precision Ag resources and solutions.